One of the things I've always been concerned about is how little information I got as I was about to enter the world of medicine. Ever since that happened, I said there must be a way to impart that information to young people and their parents. It helps us get a head start on other people who are also interested in the profession, not only diagnosing illnesses, but also being able to conduct yourself around patients. It definitely lets me know that I'm really going to go for a career in the health field. Before I was unsure, but this really helps make my decision. At NSLC, we try very hard not to be talking heads. The last thing we want to do is stand in front of students and give them lectures. To give experiences where you have hands-on opportunities, not just something that was written in a dusty textbook. This is crucial for getting focus of where you want to go. The equipment is actually real world. We did dissections, but you don't really get to do that kind of thing in school. You're holding the scalpel. I think most people learn the best that way, and that's the best way to be taught. Everything can be Googled, everything can be looked up online, and yet the ability to learn about the medical professions, I think comes fast from programs like this. And this is what medical schools in America are looking for these days. And I encourage them to think broadly about health professions. It's not just being a doctor. Hearing from a professional, it's really interesting and helpful because you can see the opportunities that they had and it's a guidance for us. When I came to NSLC, I knew I wanted to do something in the medical professions, but I had no idea how to get there. Coming to NSLC gave me confidence in myself and the fact that I can achieve my goals and my dreams. I'm going to be way ahead in college and it's going to be so much easier for me to learn about the medical field.